Super exciting, everyone. I'm coming at you from Morocco. We are in Agadir, and I'm in the most stunning hotel ever, or shall I say, a Riyadh. Uh, I just, literally just got to my hotel room, so I'm gonna take a tour with you. Let's start from the front. Here's a nice little overview for you. Wow, it's huge, absolutely huge. And I'm here with Garnier. Look at this beautiful, oh my gosh, that's a handwritten note. And a beautiful blanket and a basket. We are here to talk all about argan oil um, because that is what they use in these products. So I'm really excited to learn more about that um, over the next couple of days. Ooh. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. There's the shower. I don't know if you want to see the toilet, but there's a toilet. <laughs> oh my gosh. And I also just realized that I have this huge balcony. What? Look at my balcony, guys. This is amazing. And another hat and a scarf. Wow. This is absolutely stunning. It's lunchtime and I am starving, Marvin. And we are going to this gorgeous, I think this must be a hotel, um, but there is a restaurant in here. Look at these beautiful fountains leading up to it. Yum, 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 I'm sure we are in for a real treat. So yeah, I had a quick minute to refresh myself and change and feel that Moroccan energy air. And I'm really loving it, guys. I am a summer baby, so whenever there's like slightly warm weather, I just come alive. But I'm going to come even more alive when I start eating. As if that food wasn't enough, we decided to go for dessert. And yes, this is all for me. I am going to take this as a challenge. I'm looking very blue right now because we're in the party van. Um, we just had a couple of hours to ourselves to chill and relax. I called Amelia and we talked for like two and a half hours about what I couldn't tell you. Um, but anyway, it just got changed and I'll show you my outfit when we get to the restaurant. Um, and we're gonna eat dinner. So we've made it to our dinner destination. And I don't know if you can see, but there are some guys up there with um, flame torches. I don't know if that's the technical term, and they are leading the way through these beautiful buildings, I guess, to our dinner, and it smells so good. It smells really fiery and nice. Whoa. I think we get to go in now. Mm -hmm. Ooh, so these are our dinner tables tonight. I'm super excited to get down there. I'm gonna get a big comfy cushion. So nice. Good morning, everyone. I've got my uh, Spotify blasting in the background. Um, I woke up a little bit ago and I finally just hopped out of the shower. It's day two. Uh, managed to get a good night's sleep, which was really cool. And I realized I did not show you my outfit last night because it was super, super dark. So I'm gonna show you a picture I took on my phone uh, so you can see it there. One sec, let me find my phone. Okay, so here is my outfit. Um, yeah, there's my face. So basically, I wore this really cute and simple black jumpsuit. It was from ASOS. I'll have everything that I wore linked down below. And I also got these like strappy sandals from ASOS, but they're not like super high. So I really like them because they're super comfortable and they just go with everything. And then this bag, you might remember I got that in Cambodia. So that was my look last night. As you can tell, I just got out of the shower. I actually don't have much time to get ready. I really have about 20 minutes, um, but I had to wash my hair and I of course used the new Argan, so I'm just heading into the shower with you. Wow, we've never been this close. I use the new Garnier Ultimate Blends shampoo and conditioner, which is why we're here to discover Argan. But they look like this. It's called Argan Richness, and it's for very dry, unruly hair. Now, since I dyed my hair blonde, it is 
so dry. And when I say blonde, I mean more blonde. Like we put so much bleach through it. So my hair has been really dry and super hard to comb through. So I was excited to try this. And yeah, I mean, in the shower, my hair was super, super soft. I'm gonna brush through it and dry it and um, see how it looks, but it felt amazing. Oh, and I should also add that these are silicone free as well as paraben free, which is really cool. I really, really like these. And last night we learned all about the Women's Cooperative. We're gonna be visiting it today, but just to give you some brief background on it. Um, what I learned last night is that Garnier employs over 600 women at fair wages, and it means that these women can now support their families. Um, apparently in this area, there aren't very many jobs, so a lot of people have had to like move into the cities, but because of this you know, Argon industry, they can now support their families and they get fair wages, which is amazing. And um, I also learned that Morocco is the only place where Argon trees grow naturally. So we're gonna be heading to this forest, which is, um, I think it's like some sort of a UNESCO site. And um, it's gonna be really, really amazing. We're gonna meet the women. We're gonna, I think some of their kids are gonna be there too, which will be cute. And we're gonna just see how they get the argan oil from the argan tree. So that will be awesome. Now, like I said, I've only got 20 minutes. So let me get ready. So I just brushed my hair out, which was actually very easy. That conditioner is really good. And I thought I'd show you, I'm wearing this top. It's from a brand called Priory. I don't know if you can see the back of it, but it has this uh, really nice little detail there. I love this shirt. It's so cool. And I'm also just gonna dig in my basket and find this lotion, which is also part of the range. I don't know if it's called the lotion. This is in French, but I'm pretty sure this is just like a lotion. So I'm just gonna put a little of this in between my hands and rub it through my hair for extra softness. This breakfast spread is insane. <laughs> and Sophie just said this is the best chocolate cake she's ever had. So I'm gonna have a bite of that. I'll let you know my real opinion. You weren't wrong. Mmm. Good. Gotta try it. <laughs> okay, so we have made it outside, and I just announced on my Instagram stories that where we're going. There is no Wi-Fi, <laughs> so um, lucky for the vlog, I'm just gonna record this and put it online later. So anyway, today, like I said, we are off to the Women's Cooperative. It's a two hour drive, and I am super excited to see what's in store. Apparently there's an amazing tent situation. And um, yeah, I just saw a camel walking around over there. So we are definitely in Morocco. We made the driver stop because my, I just had to come see this water. It's just so beautiful. It's so amazing. I'm a native of uh, Arsmo village, this village uh, named Arsmo. I was closely related to my uh, late grandfather, who displayed total uh, love and, to and loyalty to this village. He keeps telling me to continue visit the Arsmo village and to do my best to help uh, the habits, especially girls and women. And I thought to set up a women's club to teach girls the village sewing skills and electricity course. Uh, we do the harvest in the July and, uh, and August. 
now is not uh, is not here, so we have to wait. We don't pick up the fruit from uh, from the, um, the tree. So we wait that that the fruit will be pure. Then it falls down, and the color change. So the color will be brown, and we pick up it from the the lens. Then we take it, and we we it's dried at sun dried. Uh, about one month. So here's a giant room with all of the nuts they've collected and it smells so good. It smells kind of like cocoa beans but um, wow that's a lot of nuts. So now we are in a room where the ladies are basically separating the fruit from the nuts. This is the stage where they actually crack the nuts. I'll let you hear it. And they're using rocks to crack them. Can I see? Oh, wow. I can't do it. Guys, it's so hard. I can't do it. It's, it is so hard. These are so hard to put through, and these ladies are literally just like one tap and they've done it. Okay, so once you do all of this cracking, then you're left with these. So this is like the inside, this is the, the creme de la creme inside the argan fruit. And they're so tiny, like if you actually just look at this, this is what they're pressing to get the oil. Like it's very small, so it's quite a lot of work just to get the oil, it's amazing. Okay, so we are now in the labs. I have on my lab coat and my lab shoes. And basically, you can see here, they put the nuts in here, up at the top, they put the nuts in, and they're pressed. You can see the oil comes out here, and then all the little extra bits come out here. This stuff here is called the oil cake. You can see how much has actually come out. Now, this stuff here, with all this leftover bit, can be fed to the cattle and livestock and stuff, so really nothing goes to waste. Just got finished walking around the cooperative and we got a great tour of what they do here. I couldn't actually film this particular part, but they actually have a daycare that they provide um, for the women if they have like smaller kids and they, they don't have someone to watch their kids while they come to work, so they provide that for them here. And also, all the women who work here are required to do two hours of literacy um, schooling, which is provided to them from the cooperative. So, like, it's really amazing to see this, and all the women are just, like, super excited to show us around and show them, um, you know, what they're doing here and stuff. So, I think it's really changed a lot of women's lives, and it's been a really cool experience. So lunch is served here under the sun. We are sitting in this beautiful tented area surrounded by the argan trees and we're excited to dig in. Yum. Good morning everyone. It's a Saturday morning here in Morocco and I just got back from the gym and my camera's about to die and it's not charging for some reason but uh, <laughs> Anyway, just had a good workout. We're just about to have a hammam experience, which is basically when someone like bathes you and scrubs you and massages all in one. And then we're gonna have a blow dry, which is gonna be amazing with the Argan products. So I'm gonna try to film the blow dry. I can't film the hammam. Right, so I'm just out by the pool because I wanted to show you my hair. Isn't it squishy and bouncy? So basically in the hammam, they wash you, they scrub you, and then they rinse you off. And they also washed and conditioned my hair with the Argan products. And then I went and got a blow dry. And it's just so smooth and it's so soft. I absolutely love it. Um, but unfortunately, I don't have time to hang out by the pool. I have to go pack up all my stuff and uh, that's it. I'm gonna do one of these face masks because uh, Garnier left these in my room. So now I don't know which mask to do. I think I might do the hydrating mask. I love this one so much and my skin's been really dry 
So I think I'm gonna put this on while I pack. So let me put it on, I'll show you. My battery is about to die, but I wanna show you this mask. And then you kind of like straighten it out, take this blue bit off, and then you have to match up these holes on my face. Ah. <laughs> All right guys, so I'm gonna put this on. Ooh, I'm scary. And then I'm gonna finish packing and then I'm off to the airport. Oh yes. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was really, really fun. It was really educational and I loved every second. Okay, I'm gonna go pack now. Oh, and I'm gonna leave links to all of my outfits down below and I'm also gonna leave some information about the Women's Cooperative in the description box. So if you wanna check that out, open up the description box, give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you later. Bye.